The SDS-5 takes a 5cc disposable sterile syringe and industry standard lure needles. This head is also available in 10, 30, and 60 cc's. This is ideal for low viscosity, room temperature emulsifiables, liquids, and gels, including biologicals. Now we're going to talk about the Hyrel SDS syringe dispensing system. These modular heads go in just like any other print head. This one is actually a CSD because it's got this cross-linking LED array for photo initiating cross-linking in your resins. We have these at a variety of wavelengths. This plugs in and it takes, uh, we have sizes that take a 60 milliliter syringe, a 30 milliliter syringe, a 10, and a 5. This one I have that I'm showing you today is the 10 milliliter, 10 cc syringe model. The SDS-10 or actually the CSD-10, but they all work the same way. Uh, the body houses the syringe. You will have to tip off, snip off one of the the fins on the syringe so that I can insert like this and it's ready to advance and retract for dispensing you want to make sure your lure tip is long enough to go out below the LEDs if you have the cross-linking version uh, this body slides up and down on a ball screw which activates the plunger up and down the syringe is held in the bottom part the LEDs are down here. They're operated by an M106 command, just the same that would operate your fan on a, a standard print head. Your circuit board here, you've got the same 3 millimeter screws. Take a 2.5 millimeter hex driver for adjusting the positioning if you have to uh, adjust how it sits. The programming port here for your ST-Link. If you have to do a firmware update, you would flash it with your ST-Link. This connector brings the power from the board and signal up to the motor, which uh, advances and retracts. It's got a small belt here, which activates this ball screw, which brings your dispenser up or down. The LEDs are the same as all of our LEDs. If you can see them on there, it's a heartbeat, CAN bus, transmit, receive, error. On the other side, there's no heater on this one. We do have a heated version called the heated syringe dispenser or the volcanic syringe dispenser, which gets up to 75C. So the first light on the right side would be heater power. And then the, the fan light, in this case, indicates when the LEDs are active. And then there's motor direction and motor power. This version is for room temperature, emulsifiables, resins, biologicals, low viscosity stuff because the plastic syringe only has plastic threads for the lure tip. And if you have a really dense or viscous material, these plastic threads can strip out and force the needle off. So for your higher density stuff like your clays, you want to use a metal dispenser like the EMO. But for low viscosity stuff, this is the ticket. For more information, see highrail3d.com or highrail3d.net.